This is amazing. Bathroom, look at this gorgeous bathroom. This is a studio. <clears throat> However, wow. I love the aesthetic of, oh my goodness. This is insane. It's a studio, but it's the biggest studio by this particular hotel uh, company, resort company. Biggest one I've ever seen. Because it has, <laughs> it has a little area where the, uh, where the bed sits by itself with a closet, a big TV. This is absolutely insane. This is insane. This is not a studio. <laughs> this is amazing. This is like a one bedroom, one bedroom suite. The best world, Wyndham I've seen, world marked by Wyndham. We own timeshare. We own property with them, or however you say it. Insane. Absolutely insane. It's amazing. Look at the fixtures. Stainless steel. Look at this giant whirlpool. All of them are whirlpool. Good lord, this is bad, way better than my, <laughs> my own kitchen. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Giant fridge. My goodness. Wow. Amazing. Big old giant island. I love it. I love the concrete ceilings. I don't know if I didn't break something. Anyway, that's great. That's great, incredible. We have a decent view, uh, but everything is dark right now outside the window, so I'm just gonna leave that. I need to like the aesthetics of a place in order to fully enjoy it. <laughs> Steam showers, lockers. This is milk and honey, by the way. Supposedly it's been rated. There's a steam shower. Amazing. It's been rated uh, one of the best, best spot in um, Austin. That's where I am. Just taking pictures. For my sister and others who asked. Yeah, so that's where I am. About to enjoy a few hours, three and a half, four hours, I believe, of of um, pampering. Hallelujah! <laughs> I did this last year on a smaller scale. This time, I'm staying in a resort by myself for three nights, four days, three nights. It's been amazing. A lot of detoxing, prayer, praise, crying. It's very, been having a great cathartic time cooking from scratch. Everything that I want to eat and not my family. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's been amazing. Anyway, all right, I'm about to go in. I just left the uh, the spot and came straight to True Food Kitchen. I don't want to show anybody's face, so I'm not gonna look all around. But I've got their. Um, I ordered one of the uh, the new. Oh, what's the name of the pizza? The newest pizza. I think their summer menu just uh, dropped yesterday, and so that's what this is with gluten-free crust because I am allergic to wheat. And this whole trip that I'm doing, this whole little uh, birthday vacation is all um, guilt-free so uh, 
guilt-free detox. So everything I'm purchasing, everything I'm ordering and eating is, there are no sensitivities, no allergies involved and all that. So this is really good. If you have a true food kitchen in your, um, in your city, try it out. This thing is one of the best pizzas I've ever had in my life. Seriously. And this drink is pretty good too. Anyway, delicious. Y'all, I tore up that whole pizza. That thing was one of the best pizzas I've ever had. It's so delicious. And this is their um, no wheat chocolate cake. She brought a can. I should have. I should have let it sit there. I mean, I should have uh, recorded while this was still lit. But she brought a candle so I could make a wish. <laughs> Anyway, so good and this ice cream is vanilla from a local farm, which is super cool I'm like in Austin guys. I'm loving it Look love, love the vibe here It's beautiful over here guess where I am This is the capital capital building my hotel resort is right literally about point two miles away from here so I had to go ahead and check out the capital trying to get a good shot of the whole thing. I doubt that I'll be able to, but. It's my first time being here. It's my first time being to Austin. I've been in Dallas for 15 years this year. First time being to Austin. Oh, now this, this relates to me a bit. Guys, I'm not a Texan. I mean, it's cool to see Capitol buildings and whatnot. I am not a Texan though. <laughs> I'm a Cali girl. So, I mean, I like to see really cool architecture and <laughs> all that stuff. This relates to me more than the Capitol would. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Really cool, Texas African American History Memorial. Look at the detail. Not sure if anyone else is interested in any of this, but this is part of my trip, so this is what will be shown. Here's the south entrance. Whew. Pretty darn impressive. <laughs> Hey guys, it's been a while. <laughs> a lot is happening, but I'm on my birthday trip, so I've got plenty of time to just browse and rest and rest and browse and sleep and eat and all that. So I'll be coming in here a little while. A little while. I actually purchased something from the sale. There's a 50% off sale. Everything is at 50% off now. So the same styles. I haven't really been into bags lately. And not coach bags. I haven't even been to a store in a long time. But since I'm here in town and I'm killing time just having fun, I figured I would check it out. Anything new? We've still got Bandit, Tabby, uh, Tabby Messenger. I'll do a reveal, I guess, or an unbagging since they bagged it up. So pretty. So pretty. Hi, I'm 40 now, guys. <laughs> and here's more over here. That Rogue 20 is so attractive. Yeah. 
And I'll take you back to see the, uh, to see the, um, sale items. I don't think I'm going to use my birthday discount today because I don't see anything. I mean, I'm not buying anything on full price. And that's the only time we can use our 10% off. I use it at the outlet. I'm not even sure if I use my 10% um, off insider birthday reward last year. I don't think I did. Because I don't purchase full price. As you all well know, unless it's a made to order rogue or made to order anything. Now this actually, I, I am slightly considering this. This is the, uh, the Bandit card case. Full grain leather, just like the Bandit. I was kind of considering this is 95 bucks normally, but I kind of want to wait until they go and sell farther. But it's so cute. Fit what one, two, three card, card uh, credit cards back there, and then another one here, and then like like five to ten in there, five to seven. It's so cute, right? They've got black and denim. Again, 95 bucks. Full grain leather. Here's the oh, it has the same interior. The whole thing is um, leather, except this part. This part is probably in the back. Oh. Yeah, in the back it's uh, it's not leather either, but it's fabric, which I don't mind. The interior. The interior is leather also. The interior, the big part. You see full grain. Love it. No one uses full grain unless they're, you know, one of those. Uh, I don't know what type, the full grain um, companies that I per have purchased from, like Go Forth Goods, Portland Leather Goods, KMM, those that use full grain. However, most regular mainstream, most regular mainstream um, brands do not. This is attractive. Look at the stitching. This is cute. It's lightweight too. Roll candles. What is this? Oh, look how cute this bag is how pretty wow and the sides open I saw a chain in here guys look at this oh it's part of a chain this is a rogue strap but with a, a bit of a chain a couple of links what is this one second the zipper was so smooth it has a magnetic closer y'all this bag what's the interior a nice solid canvas and this is the jacquard canvas textile uh, textile whatever they call this feet on the bottom uh, with the oh come on with the leather strips let's see how this looks guys <laughs> oh my goodness look at that you can change the silhouette oh my goodness y'all anyway this is the the Reese what I haven't been keeping up, so I don't know what it is. Tote 28. Look at it. Look at it. I don't like how their stitching has been off lately. Look at this. The stitching isn't perfect. Oh my god, no. Look at that. I don't like that. I don't know what happened with their old machines, but these new machines don't know what the heck they're doing. <laughs> no, I'm... I'm talking bad about them, but no, that's one of the things, like the the, the um, quality is one of the things that I haven't really been loving recently, so I haven't been, I haven't been looking at Coach very much lately. I really haven't, honestly, and uh, yeah, but it's fun to be back in here. This is cute. This is cute. Oh my goodness, and it's so lightweight. This is cute. I know. We're getting back the large one as well, too. Yes, there was a larger one? Larger size. What is that, like a 36, 31? A little bit smaller than the full toe. It is quite large. Oh, wow, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is like a nice like vacation. Right, toe. yeah. I love how lightweight these are. Mm -hmm. it's really and cute. this, of course. I would snatch this off and carry it and use this with some rogues, though. <laughs> it's so nice. Absolutely. It's so nice. Yeah. To or to make it yep. Extreme. Exactly. The more details they put in the bag, the more I love it. That's really cute. That's really cute. So, what I purchase is in here. 
and it's bagged up. I will, when I get back to the resort, I will do an unboxing. An unbagging, maybe, or maybe tomorrow. Maybe when I get home, I don't know. This is so cute though. So what else? What else is in here? Oh, I just saw this for the first time up close today. This looks like leather from afar, but it's actually metal. You see that? Metal, 125. I'm guessing the um, gold one is also 125. Gold and black, yep, 125. Very nice. Swinger's still here. Guys, seriously. I mean, I thrifted a bag just like this, like years ago. Even the same doggone handle. I don't know what they're doing, but they're bringing the 2000s back. That was the era of many of us. <laughs> it's gonna offend some people. This is the era many of us left coach. Seriously. <laughs> Absolutely not. This is not me whatsoever. Oh my God. It's this this right here, the leather trim. I do like that they're bringing it back for those who loved this era. That's great. And they've even doubled up on the, they've done this before too, doubled up on the straps. But I tell you, seriously, I've had, I forgot which color it was, but I had that exact freaking bag. I did, I had it already. This also looks like the 2000s, early 2000s era. Oh. No. Oh, look at this. I don't know what this backpack is called, but check this out in store. I mean, in uh, online and in store if you can. It has a rolled top. I actually really like that type of backpack. Very attractive. And, but not a whole lot is new. Oh, look at this though. This, oh, this one looks so nice. Look how the leather one looks. It looks so great, doesn't it? Here's the back. I don't know the name or the price, and I'm sorry. I don't have a ton of time right now, guys, but uh, look at this. You wear this across the chest or the back. I think there's one crossbody strap. I mean, one, one strap. Look how cute it is. It's so cute if it's in my hand. <laughs> it's so cute. Look how cute it is. I had to get a picture. So adorable, it's exactly like the large one here. Check that out online also. Okay, and we've still got this backpack in here. Was there a large one last time? I forgot which one came out first. Bucket and then crossbody. I don't know the names of any of these, I'm sorry. And then really quickly, here is what they have on sale here. Phil Totes, Willow, that backpack we just looked at. Look at this one, this is so cute. With Vaquetta leather trim. The leather trim is Vaquetta leather, which means it's gonna darken over time. It's super cute. I'm not into fabric a whole lot though. As, you know, exterior of a bag. Studio. Would have bought that if it was a different type of leather. Look, these things were just came out. They just came out, and they're already they're already 50% off, guys. If you see anything you like, I'm at the Aust uh, I'm in Austin. Which one is this? If you want the uh, if you want the name, look how cute that would look. Super cute. They've got a Rogue 12. Cute. I can't buy this. I can't use it for anything. I'm not carrying something that tiny.
We've got a road 20 back there, guys. That's pretty, actually. Luna up at the top, which is adorable. And there's Faded Blue. We have one of the, uh, the new style. Is that 1941 red? That's leather inside, right? That comes with a pouch also. Here's a ruby. I know somebody, somebody's gonna want that ruby because they are discontinued now, so you might want to grab it when you see it. Day tote, there's a Ergo back there. Market, they keep bringing out Market. These, I feel like they just came out. But they're already on sale. That ain't good, is it? Those also look like they're from the like uh, 2010s, early, early in 2010s. This is cute, perfect summer bag. I'm sorry, I don't. I have time enough to do, come in here, but I don't have time enough to go through everything. I'm sorry. Also, this is not a location I normally come to, so I don't want to wear out my welcome. This is so cute with a cross green interior. And it comes with a pouch. I'm sure they've had other colors on sale. I'm not sure, but I'm gonna guess they did. And Lori, is that the Lori? This is adorable. <sighs> I don't need Ruby. I don't need, really don't need a Ruby. My girls would try to snatch this from me. Rogue 20. This is pretty. I'm not into color block, especially. Location is this? I don't know what location this is, but um, they this is what they have, and I'll try to remember to put their phone number if I can't get the location. If I don't remember to get the name from them, then I will try to remember to put their phone number. All right, guys, this is it. Those Luna's Luna looks cute in every color, guys. I like the yellow, faded blue, and purple. That pink is cute too. Alright guys, next time you see me, I should be at the outlet. I'm going shopping at the San Marcos outlet tomorrow. I'm excited before I head back to Dallas and to my family, take back over from my husband, who is such a jewel for allowing me, not allowing me, but for being really cool with me coming. He's so excited for me. <laughs> so many of my relatives and loved ones are so excited that I was able to do this. Like, yeah! One of my um, sisters prayed, God, extend the time. Let it feel like it's like a week instead of a couple of days. A few days, it's been a few days. And I was, I was sitting there, yeah, amen, amen. <laughs> okay, I like the detail. I don't like the yarn. I don't like the fact that that's not leather. All right, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.